There's the rookie quarterback in Chicago where Caleb Williams just, I don't know, there seems to be no rhythm at all. We haven't seen a lot of those. I mean, listen, he, he threw his first touchdown pass to Roma Dunze. Doesn't have Ken, Keenan like Allen, that. right? Yeah, Keenan's been the out. running game is just non-existent. There was a fourth and one Dreadful. on the goal line that went, that went viral yesterday where all five, it seemed, Chicago Bears offensive linemen were on the ground on their backs as DeAndre Swift lost, what, 10 yards? Well, there was an option play to the left, and Dude. Caleb was like, had four guys in his face, was like, you take it. And well, Swift the one that I'm, the yards. one that I, they, because every yeah. single Colt was five yards deep, one snap, one second after the snap. Yeah. So bad. the line just was, it was bad. It was awful. Yeah. And that's the question is like, so behind a line like that, you throw it 52 times. So, yeah, yeah. everyone's going to be talking about two touchdowns for Caleb, 363 yards. Well, he also had to make up for throws in that building because he didn't throw there at the combine. I know. Those were his first throws in that building. <laughs> After uh, the game, we we heard all about it. Yeah, we got to have more balance. And today, is it t- is this from today? From Caleb or is this after yesterday? Okay, this is what Caleb had to say about the uh, play imbalance. Hit it. Got our first two passing touchdowns of the year. Um, you know, obviously, which is feels good, exciting to get that going finally um, in the second half of this. You know, this game. Um, so having the offense, I, you know, identity is. I think it, it is brewing. I think it is um, a lot closer than you know um, it was the, the week before or, or weeks before. Um, um, and I think uh, us figuring that out um, is 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 going to get this thing going. Um, I think we're right there. Um, it's it's, you know, on, on all the plays we were just simply you know one 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 small detail or, um, and that, I mean that's myself included on on some of these you know some of these plays that that happened today, um, um, but we're we're one small detail um, you know a lot of these plays that um, like I've like I've said. In, Many other um, interviews that you know these these small details always add up to be something bigger. Remember we had Jalen Johnson on. I think it was uh, the day after the ESPYS. Remember that during the summer? Yeah, he was in from here. the Bears. No, he was on. We zoomed with him. He was um, we zoomed with him the day after the ESPYS, and he said, "I said, what what do you what's your message to Bears fans?" He said, "Patience." Mm. He said, "Patience," and after we you know. Hung up with him, or whatever the phrase is with Zoom, ended the meeting. We were like, patience, huh? Because a lot of people are really excited about this kid and what they can do, and it's all set up, and you know, he's got the weapons, he's got every, an improved line around him. But sure enough, they're not anywhere close to an identity. I have no idea what they're doing. Mm-hmm. It, it, it looks like he's running around and just throwing it. That's what it looks like to me. More often than not, just sometimes running for his life, just figuring it out, and they're not they're not establishing this and then working off of that or doing this and working off of that. They're just they're just they're yeah. just they're just snapping it and throwing it. That's what it seems like, right? Am I wrong? I would say their identity is their defensive football team. Yeah, you got I mean, it. But you know what? Defensive football teams don't do throw fifty two times. Yeah, they can't, yeah, you're not really run they can't, can't run the ball and they can't protect the quarterback, which is bad news for a rookie back there. Next up for them are the Rams, who are feeling it right now. Four oh, min- four minutes man. from 0 three. <laughs> and the Bears are a Will Levis brain fart or two away from being 0 three, also. Yeah, true. They could have won. The Bears could be 3-0 and if, if they had some sort of... You could make that case for every team yeah. in the league. Good call. Catch the Rich Eisen Show every single day on the Roku channel, 12 to 3 Eastern, for free.